Have you ever wondered why in a crowd, people often don't rush to help someone in need? The bystander effect is a social psychological theory that states that individuals are less likely to offer help to a victim when there are other people present. It was first studied in depth by psychologists Bib Latane and John Darley following the tragic case of Kitty Genovese in 1964. Genovese was stabbed and killed in her apartment building in Queens, New York. The attack lasted for 35 minutes, and during that time, 38 people heard her screams for help. However, no one called the police until after she was dead. Darley and Latane conducted a series of experiments to study the bystander effect. In one experiment, they had participants fill out a questionnaire in a room. While the participants were filling out the questionnaire, smoke began to fill the room. In some cases, the participant was alone in the room. In other cases, there were two other people in the room with the participant. The results of the experiment showed that people were more likely to report the smoke if they were alone in the room than if there were other people in the room with them. There are a number of reasons why the bystander effect happens. One reason is that people assume that someone else will help. This is known as diffusion of responsibility. When there are other people around, we feel less responsible for taking action. Another reason why the bystander effect happens is that people are afraid of being wrong. If we intervene and the person doesn't need our help, we might feel embarrassed or foolish. There are a number of things we can do to overcome the bystander effect. One thing we can do is to make eye contact with other people in an emergency situation. This can help to break the diffusion of responsibility. We can also speak up and encourage others to help. This will help to reduce social loafing. Finally, we can also be the ones to take action and break this effect. The bystander effect is a real phenomenon that can have serious consequences. However, there are things we can do to overcome the bystander effect and help others in need. Thanks for watching and do consider liking and subscribing for more psychology related content.